Good day, folks. This is part two of repairing the bazooka antenna. What I've done, I've uh, taken the original wire was broken, and I've uh, soldered on a little lug and screwed that up through with a stainless steel screw. And I have a wing nut here as well that uh, permits any if you want to change the wire at any point in time. It's very easy to do. And I've upgraded to a number 12 wire as well. So uh, we're not using an 18. And I do believe the original one was an 18 wire. <laughs> very, very, very small wire. What failed was the wire, but not the strain relief that was built inside the wire. This cord is extremely tough. It was more difficult to cut than the wire itself. And on the main part here, we've just looped this end. To go on the other end of the choke. And the same thing with the choke. I've used that piece of PVC pipe to act as a strain relief and put it directly through the choke. So now the end of the wire just goes on here and your wing nut will tighten down. Same thing here, I've uh, installed, soldered on some uh, lugs for the original wire that was in there. So that takes all the strain off of that original wire in the choke. And these uh, wing nuts, I've crimped the end see that too good. You crimp the end of the screws a little bit. So these wing nuts are, and the rest of the washers there now are captive. They will not uh, come off unless you take some pliers and physically twist them off. So you won't lose them even if they do come loose. And this makes it a lot easier if you want to uh, change your wire in the future. Because after a couple of years of blowing around in the wind, wire will eventually break off. Of course, that's what happened to the original one, huh? But uh, this makes it much easier, much more user-friendly. If you want to replace the wire, just measure out the original length and uh, make a little loop into it, like so. Very easy to do. And uh, loop it in around, tighten down your wing nut, and way to go. You got lock washers on there too, so once you screw it down, it becomes uh, relatively secure. Thank you for watching, folks. Hope you joined this little repair videos. And uh, who knows, you yourself may have a bazooka at antenna at some point in time. And who knows, you may want to repair it. You may have the same trouble that uh, this ham had with his bazooka. But anyway, it's a relatively easy fix. Not very complicated at all. A little bit of stainless steel hardware. Drill a couple of holes and so on. And cut up a little bit of plastic which cuts pretty easy so uh, relatively uh, easy repair thank you for watching folks hope you're having a great day bye bye